is my transition between physical life and the death dimension. The new banshee's bright eye scanning me through. Panic ensues as she cries her mechanical tune. The sound of someone's sanity unraveling loose, heard within the sky high as ivy off boo. That is the cue. You have to gather your suits, shoes black as the mood, marching through the parish en route to attend another funeral. Stand as you view and pray we never send the men in yellow jackets for you. Because half the people I know here are dealing with some mental torture. Chopper, overhead the water levels of a stress disorder. In need of help. Could really use a friend to talk, but you've been taught that needing help was something to resent the thoughts of. I guess the cost of being cut from rebel cloth was these mental blocks that we use to build defensive walls up. Like, keep your gob shut, wished up, don't make it awkward. Say thanks for asking. But I'm fine, yeah. God of Margaret. Yours, boo, violence and me. Never knew enough to know when we were depressed, see? So drink and drugs roll with sleazy sex scenes as things done to cope with PTSD. What's PTSD? Is it tablets or powder? Do you smoke it or what cause? Much is an ounce what? Would you sell a gold chain? Swab of brown stuff? I hope John's there as well now if you want, cuz. What you mean, compensating? Shoot no me. Hi. Melt you up there. I'm gonna shoot this gummy. These actions set our minds in a state of subconscious panic. This subject is unaware, thus unable to process damage. A chronic addict who's not in the mood for you talking, phallics. A blessing common with you than I do with my box of Xanax. Overdose once. Twenty tablets and lemon haze. Felt my body shake as my spirit began to levitate. Ascending toward the heavens, it felt like I knew the mental state of every single monk in Tibet when they tried to meditate. I made it up to heaven and stood naked at heaven's gates. Better days, yes! I knew I was in a better place. Until St. Peter approached me with his little pen and page, looked me up and down and said, Cousin, what's your second name? 